Have you guys ever seen a hummingbird in its nest? <laughs> Peppy! Oh, uh, OSHA non-compliance, I have angered the wasp population! Like all of them? Okay, quick question, do werewolves eat dog food or human food? A asking for a friend? Mm, I don't know if I trust that. L plus ratio plus don't care plus fleshy showered plus lying in my bed plus got my jammies on. Mm, what if? People about to find out that Bowser is canonically tone deaf the worst way possible, huh? Yes, because here's the thing. Jack Black is a trained professional singer, which means he knows how to sound off key. Oh, October, be kind. On God, be kind. I'm handing out chocolate and tea to everyone we're blogging this. Good luck, friends. I wish you all the best. You've heard of humans being severely injured to reveal mechanical insides. Now get ready for a far more horrifying alternative. Machines and technology being damaged to reveal meaty, bloody insides. When you're a space alien, you know, the first human you ever encounter is an aggressive medieval knight. Now stand aside, worthy adversary. Tis but a scratch. A what? You know what? Writers can have a little italicized oh uh -huh. as a treat. You've earned it. You know, some fictional characters are relatable in a gender way, not because they're non-conforming, but because they're so incredibly into performing their assigned gender that it somehow wraps all the way around. Like some sort of gender overflow error. Barbie? He-Man? Johnny Bravo? Alright, now that the Mario movie trailer has been released, be prepared for the minions to sing the Mario theme song in a high-pitched tune, followed by some violent slapping and a coin block SFX being played. You know I'm right. Bruh, did you seriously not go potty before you left the house? Bruh. Bruh. Did you not make bears? Duh. In my opinion, the biggest Pokemon flex isn't getting a shiny, but capturing a legendary Pokemon with a normal Pokeball first try. Bonus points if shiny, though. I mean, that's, that, that's good. Yeah, that's, that's good. Probably bad RPG ideals. The villain is called the Super Hulock. Because they're super powerful, no one knows who they truly are. And they're a warlock. Super Hulock. Andy, write this down, please. I beg you. You know, skaters literally have a lifestyle sent around a piece of wood with tiny wheels. And you have a lifestyle centered around a little keyboard and a kid's show plushie. What's your fucking point? Wow, the skaters are out to get me. The entire skate fandom wants to be dead. <laughs> Children in horror movies are great because they commit. Trying to get an adult to scream in terror requires them to unlearn all the societal teachings that tell them not to be loud or startling. Children are ready to put 110% of their lung capacity into making noise at any time. It, it's it's great. I, I wish. I wish I could learn this. Why nighttime gotta be so damn peaceful? The fucking nerve of her. So beautiful. Mwah. I love you. Behold the above. A violet-backed starling. He looks like a galaxy. <gasps> he fancy!